So as I'm walking through Sephora, I'm realizing that over 80 to 90% of the brands here didn't exist when I started as a makeup artist, which was almost 20 years ago. Let's turn out the video, let's turn around. Rare Beauty, no. Patrick Tom, no. Givenchy, yes. Estee Lauder, yes. God Have Mercier, yes. Yves Saint Laurent, yes. Charlotte Tilbury, no. Enti, no. Is this fun? Yeah. Isn't this insane how many new brands have launched? Makeup Forever, yes. They've been around for almost 40 years, actually, because they're an OG artistry brand. Glossier, no. Lawless, no. Beauty, no. Ilia, no. Tower, no. It Cosmetics, yes. NARS, yes. House Labs, no. Benefit, yes. Huda, no. You're going too fast. <laughs> Merit, no. Mario, no. From the K, yes. Milk, no. Anastasia. Just her brows existed as services. I don't think her full brand existed. The real question is, who's still going to be here 20 years from now? And what new brands are going to come out? <laughs> what I think Sephora's going to run out of space. I think we're going to stitch this video 20 years from now. Honestly, I'm not even kidding. <laughs>